Hi everyone, Carrie here. I have a micro mini journal that I made for a swap on Junk Journal Junkies. So I'm going to show you, this is a teeny little thing. It's three and a quarter by two and a quarter, not including the lace. So I made a little mini chunky charm. I get that for your, can you see? Got some neat little things. I got a little tag here that says dream, a little key. Um, I have a little silver butterfly. I don't know how well I'm keeping this in focus. Butterfly. I'll try to do it the right way. A little butterfly. Um, it's hanging using one of the Tim Holtz vintage pens. There's some lace in it, a bunch of beads. Okay, now for the front of the journal. We have lace all the way around and a double row at the bottom. Okay, here in the middle I have some stained cheesecloth. I have this little cameo rose and a little pink ribbon. Okay, the closure is just some organza and satin ribbon tied in a bow. Alrighty, now I'll say I had fun making this, but I think I like making bigger ones. Making the little one, all that teeny stuff, it's getting a little difficult. So, this is two signatures. And we'll get this open to start. Alright, so. Here's the first page, which is some vintage wrapping paper. And we flip it over. It's got a double pocket. So here in the front pocket, I have a little mini journaling card and a couple little mini tickets. And in the back pocket, I have another little mini journaling card. And let's try to get these things back in. Because they're so teeny. Yeah, there we go. Come on, back in. There we go. And then leave these back in here. Okay. Then this is a little stained um, index card with a little perfume bottle stamped on it. This is a little piece of a glassine bag. Stuck a little journaling card in, a little tag journaling card. A little piece of music paper. This is a piece of like yellow parchment paper. Piece of coffee dye paper that I punched. This is Ah, this was a piece of um, an old vintage ordering pad that I had that I cut down to fit. A little piece of onion skin. Okay, this is a little bag that I cut, punched open on the end. And in it I stuck in this little, small little vintage ephemera thing. And uh, another little... Vintage ephemera that could be used as journaling cards. Just slip in there. This is just some pretty pink paper that I actually I got this in the Christmas of July swap that I had done. It includes some of this paper, so I took some, but I'm going to just punch the sides and I added this little tag that says beautiful. This is a vintage sheet. It's a little piece of a order book or something. Okay. And that's it. So it says it's a, the book for the weekly time ending. Okay. And then this is my where I stitched the pamphlet. Stitches for center of the first signature. Here's some more of the pink punched paper. Huh. The other side of the bag. And in it, I have this little 
punched card that I did out of a piece of scrapbook paper that could be used for journaling. And then I have a little mini journaling card. And those both just fit in the bag. The onion skin and the vintage order tablet, which is kind of fragile. The coffee dyed paper. Uh, this is the yellow parchment paper, and I put a little sticker on it that says a perfect day. The music paper. Uh, the other side of the little bag, and in it I have a little mini tag, and then a little mini library card. It's just kind of tucked in there. Over to the next page. Okay, so I have an embellished paper clip and I have it's holding two little tickets. It says cherish and treasure. And I just have those paper clips onto the other side of the stained index card. Okay, then another little pocket, got a little mini tag in that pocket, and a little mini journaling card in that pocket. Okay, let's close. That's the end of the first signature, then we go to the second signature. I have this cardstock paper here, and when you flip it over, it makes a little tuck spot, and in the first little tuck spot here, it's just a little stamped flip out little journaling spot stamped with a little vintage looking key. It just tucks in there. Some more of that pink paper. Some more of my order tablet. And onions. Oh, this is a glass bean. Okay. Some more of the vintage paper. And I have a uh, um, embellished paper clip with a little bows on it and it was holding just this little tag that you can use as a journaling spot. Okay. Onion skin. Okay, then we have the um piece of the yellow parchment paper and I put this little mini envelope on it and then in the little mini envelope is just dropped my paper clip okay in the mini envelope is a little card that says it's a telegram it tucks in there Okay, let me go back here for just a second. Where was that at? Oh, right here. Let me I'll get that back. Okay. Um, music paper. A uh, little glass scene back. And in here, this is a picture that I punched out of a book about the Princess of Versailles. So it's just a little picture that I punched out of an old book that I thought was kind of neat and it's kind of stuck in there. A piece of cardstock. Very pretty. It's got flowers and glitter. And then on the other side, I have an embellished paper clip and under that I have a little card that says, We'll be grateful for this day. It could be journaled on. Okay, then this is a piece of coffee stained paper and to that I glued a picture from that same book that I cut out. It's kind of like a map of the area. Okay, and then I have another embellished paper clip. And this embellished paper clip is holding this little antique looking clock. And then this little journaling flip out spot. Piece of cardstock. There's the other side. Little, okay, other side of the glass bean bag. 
and in it I have this little punched scrap of cardstock weight paper that could be used for journaling and then I have this little thing here and it says if you stop dreaming you're just sleeping and you could use it to journal on the back of and those both fit in here okay music paper parchment paper uh, some onion skin um, oh, scrap of paper piece of the glassine piece in the piece of that order tablet pink paper with a little embellished paper clip and then I just have this little tag says whoops I'm not very good this says one okay and then piece of that cardstock fold it over to dangle a little tuck and it has a little mini journaling card and a little mini wow I'm really bad at this tag okay and those both just slip in there like this and that's back of that cardstock and then that's the end of the book the back of the cover is just plain with the lace and little ties so that's my uh, journal for the swap that's coming up, and I'll be getting this posted in just a little while. Thank you for watching, and have a great evening.